Hey guys, we're talking about the leaderboard workout Friday the 14th of October and we have quicksand which is one of the workouts from our vault which means we've done this, uh, this is actually only the second time we've done this workout but we did it last on 13th of November 2020 and the leaderboard is still up on Fitter if you want to take a look back and see what you got or see what other people got. Um, we've got some top scores on there, uh, one of the girls managing to get just over 10 rounds and a couple of guys almost hitting 10 rounds. So you've got the 12 minute AMRAP of 12 heavy wall balls, 9 toaster to bar and 3 ring muscle ups. The main thing here is that toaster to bar into ring muscle ups, although the rep scheme seems pretty small, it's going to catch up on you really quick if you don't pace this one well from the start. I remember from last time I did this, I decided to, I wanted to go unbroken by wall balls because that was a bit of a wheelhouse movement for me, but I knew the toaster bar would get tough. Um, I'm decent at them, but not amazing. So I went five, four, all the way through on those toaster bar to give myself a small break so that I could then try and hit those muscle ups unbroken. If you have 10 plus unbroken ring muscle ups, then you probably have the capacity to do threes all the way through this workout. But if you pace it wrong, you also have the ability to kind of crash and burn halfway through there, even if you do have 10 plus unbroken. So I would say you're either gonna break the wall balls or the toaster bar, or potentially even both. A, a wall ball break is so fast and so you're so in control of that pace that it really do, you don't lose anything. You would lose that easily five times over by being forced to break through a muscle upset. Okay, so be smart with those breaks. The RX and intermediate athletes. If you're taking on the full version, then yes, you're going to take a lot, a lot of breaks. But if you know that three muscle ups is a hard task for you, even when fresh or even slightly fatigued, then I would suggest going with these slightly modified versions where you use the lighter wall ball and we're taking away some reps from the muscle ups, adding that into the wall ball so it's the same total volume. And if you don't have muscle ups yet, then you're going to swap in the devil's press so you still get a really challenging. 12 minute AMRAP and you'll still be feeling pretty much the same as everyone else um, who's taking on the RX version. So that's this week's leaderboard workout and we'll see some results up on the leaderboard, see if we can beat what scores we got last time.